It's Quidditch, football, Kung Fu and basketball all rolled into one. In the year 2050, Era Ball rules the world. And the greatest team are the Harlem Heroes. Written by Pat Mills and Tom Tully, with art by Dave Gibbons, Massimo Bellardinelli, and Carlos Trigo. Harlem Heroes was a strip from the very first issue of 2000 AD in 1977. In Era Ball, players roar through the air wearing jetpacks, fighting off opponents to put the ball in the score tank. The Harlem Heroes, led by John Giant Clay, are unrivaled in this exciting, thrill packed sport of the future. Tragedy strikes when a hover liner crash kills all of the team bar Clay, Lewis, Slim and Harry. With Lewis so badly injured he is left as a disembodied brain in a jar. He nonetheless convinces his friends to rebuild the team and win the world championship. But things take a sinister turn when it becomes apparent that the accident was nothing of the kind and former teammate Artie Gruber, disfigured and brain damaged in an earlier match, sets out to kill Clay whom he blames for turning him into a monster. This is the kind of madcap future sports action that 2000 AD has always excelled at. Maximum violence in a science fiction setting with unabashedly insane characters doing grievous damage to each other and escalating cliffhangers. The team returned as the Harlem Hellcats for a sequel called Inferno where jetpacks were replaced by even deadlier motorbikes and the story took a very bizarre twist aided by Bellardinelli's vivid artwork. Harlem Heroes was revived a few years later, but it bore little relation to the original. Writer Michael Fleischer basically made them a glorified street gang operating in a world of corrupt corporations, though the series does boast some great artwork by the late, great Steve Dillon. Harlem Heroes and Inferno are collected in the complete Harlem Heroes, which is available from all good bookshops, Amazon and 2080's web shop and apps. Tune in next week for the next 2080 ABC and prepare yourselves for a little bit of cultural whiplash as we go from extreme future sports to insane hairdressing with Hooligan's Haircut.